Hello, today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa, I'm a crook for YouTuber. Yeah. Um, today I like, don't even know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a makeup look. So, that far I have come like in my, what I'm going to do today. And I'm going to use the Hello Bean palette from Shroud and Betty Bean. Um, this was the latest palette I used as well. It looks like this and I'm thinking about doing a green look today. Pretty sure about that. So I'm thinking to use uh, It's Showtime, Ghoulish and Wicked. I'm pretty sure at least. I am just thinking that I'm going to start with It's Showtime in my crease and then deepen it down with Wicked and take Ghoulish. Either a halo or a half cut crease. Hence said it yet. So I'm just going to start with it's showtime. And I'm so sorry I have been sick. Like you know, not like super sick. I've still been at work, so not that sick, but yeah. Kinda lose my voice for a couple of days. I hate when that happens and I'm not quite back to normal almost. You should have heard me last week. And uh, yeah. I'm not going to say that that is the reason why I haven't filmed anything. Because I, if I'm going to be honest, I don't really know the reason, or maybe I do, I don't know. I just, I haven't felt for it. And I have decided, like, if I don't feel for filming. I'm not going to do it. But at the same time, I do miss it a little bit, so yeah. I don't really know. I don't really know where I stand with my YouTube channel and uh, everything. If I'm going to be completely honest, but I don't want to talk about it again. Because it feels like the only videos I post right now is me talking about... Um, that I'm not filming and everything and I... You must be so sick and tired of me talking about that, and I am also <laughs> so sick and tired to talk about that. But what has happened since last we spoke? It's been Easter. We don't really celebrate Easter. I. There has been like a lot of things that I haven't celebrated since I moved away from home because my mom did celebrate. Uh, but when I've been living not at home, I haven't been celebrating like, I guess like Christmas and New Year's is the only things that I've been celebrating. But yeah, it has been Easter. We were at one of my boyfriend's sisters and all the, almost all the siblings were there. Ate some food and it was really nice to see them again. We don't see them that often. And I did actually had a day off work. I usually don't. I think that is also a reason why I don't like celebrate things because I'm always working. But I actually did have one day off. So yeah. Other than that, I don't think that that much has happened. We did watch the X-Files. Like we have seen all all the episodes now and I don't know how many of you have seen the X-Files and have like seen all the X-Files. The last two seasons that came so long after. Was it like 14 years between season 9 and 10? I think so. I don't know the last two seasons. If I'm going to be honest I have no idea why they even did like have them because it I don't think it added something and uh, I think the ending of the series was like they've built something up for 11 years or 11 years 11 seasons and it was over in like three minutes me and my boyfriend we watch like a lot of tv shows and different yeah tv shows I guess it is uh, we watch a lot of different tv shows and there is some that are like good like the whole way through 
and they are like ending it at the right time like Breaking Bad it is five seasons I guess or is it I think it's five but they split the last season into two so it's five or six but yeah Breaking Bad I think is one of the TV shows that is like my favorite it did really end good like I'm happy it isn't longer because I think it would have turned out to shit and it feels like they ended it like the ending was good I'm not going to tell you what's happened if you haven't seen it but then I knew other shows like True Blood I do really like True Blood but like it did go on for a little bit too long and things just got weirder and weirder and weirder and I think they should have ended it long before they did. And also, I don't know if you've seen Dexter. That is like one. But now they have continued that one, so I don't really know. But ending of Dexter... Mm, I don't know. I, I guess that is like known for being a super bad ending to a TV show. And I think it went like... Bad long before the last episode long before the ending and I think that is a common thing that they do make money of it and people do still watch it so they keep doing more and more episodes and more and more seasons and it's just getting shit some know where to stop some do not it is like with Breaking Bad no, not Breaking Bad, with The Walking Dead. I did really like the first season of Walking Dead. It's one of the best seasons I have ever seen of a TV show. Like, it is fantastic. It is so good and it, it, it is like, yeah, one of the best episodes. I think it just was six episodes or something, 11, I don't know. Not that many, but that is like one of the best things I have ever seen. Uh, then it continued because I guess they did quite a lot of money on it and I just think it went downhill. I haven't seen all of The Walking Dead. I don't know which season I'm on. Seven maybe? I have no idea but I think it's, it, it was so bad so like I didn't even want to watch it anymore. We've been talking about it, me and my boyfriend, to catch up on Walking Dead, but I don't really know. Right now we are watching The Sopranos. Sopranos? 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 Sopranos. On Swedish you say Sopranos. Sopranos? Um, I think we're like five episodes in and I really like it and then we also do watch uh, Succession mm, I don't know that is going to end now I think this is the last season that they're going to make and I it's not my kind of show my boyfriend do like it but I think even him think it's starting to get really not fun anymore going to open a new Nyx Glitter Primer because my other one did break. So yeah, that is what we are watching now. Succession and Sopranos. Okay, so I'm going to do a cut crease. Maybe you already figured that out because how is this going to be Halo I I do really like this dark green. It's uh, wicked. It was a little bit mm, powdery, so... If you maybe do your base first, be really, really careful. And I really wish that I had come up with like what I wanted to do on YouTube right now. And I really did hope that I have found my spark again, but apparently I haven't. I don't know why I I am tired. I'm not going to like try to say I'm not. I do work 
a lot right now again and I don't know I just don't I come home from work and I just don't feel like sitting down and film I don't know why I really did wish that I didn't f felt that way but I do or I don't maybe I don't know what to say so I guess you are going to see this video and then it will take three weeks again or something but one thing that I do really start to like now it is spring now in Sweden and uh, <coughs> I have always felt like yeah I'm a little bit depending on the weather but not that much but every damn year when it starts to get lighter outside and a little bit warmer it's still really light the sun is still up and it's almost 6 p.m. and uh, it's going to be light outside until like yeah, maybe one hour more and it does really affect me in a good way even though I always tell myself like I'm not affected by the weather but I couldn't be lying more because I really am and it really makes me feel better <laughs> when it's not a completely darkness I <coughs> outside because when it is the worst of the year it's like pitch black when I'm going to work and when I'm going home because it's light like a couple of hours per day in Sweden and okay I do really like those lids um, I'm going to take away the fallout so I have some um, put on my base Shoe slippy and then I'll come back. The look is done. I do love the eyes. I don't know about the face. I did use some new stuff. Now oh, I have a catch here. I did use my ordinary serum foundation, which I do really, really like. Then I used two new liquid things from a Swedish brand called Gloss Gods. I have this is here if you're wondering. Um, a contour and the blush. I don't know about them. This blush had a little bit of sparkles in it. I don't know if I like it. The contour, I guess I do like it. And uh, for my highlight, I did take this one from LH Cosmetics. It's their shaping light. On my lips, I took Rapture from Lethal. And on my watch line, I took Honey Dude from Colourpop. So, yeah. This is the finished look, and I did use three colors Googleish, Wicked, and it's Showtime. And I think that these three colors worked really good as well. So, yeah, I'm still really happy that I finally have the Halloween palette because I have I love this look and I love the other look that I did. And yeah, I guess that is all for today. I We'll see when I will see you again. If you don't want to miss out when I'm going to upload next, please do subscribe to my channel. And yeah, I don't know what more to say. Actually, um, no, maybe I don't have anything more to say that I haven't said before. I have no idea. I do hope you liked this video and I hope that I will see you in the next one. Bye!